So here is the Sunny Shampoo um, Soap Bar. It says apply the shampoo directly to wet hair. Well, my camera will just, there we go. Massage into thick foam. It's obtained, rinse as usual. The best results, repeat washing. Kindula and lemongrass. All right. I mean, blocked all the info. Thanks a lot. I wonder if this is removable. Nope. Ugh. Okay, so we can't really read much other than I see that there's olive oil in it, castor oil, shea butter, lemongrass. And citrusy things. So let's go ahead and open this guy if it'll let me. Oop, there we go. Okay. Mmm, it smells good. <laughs> it smells like lemongrass and shea butter. Real strong shea butter, lemongrass vibes. So this is what it looks like. It's one of those bars that they cut and slice it too. So I have another one of these by the same company. And um, one of the things I'll tell you right up front is that that one, oh, I can't remember what the scent of it is now that I think about it. It's a green one though. But um, it lathered up really well. And the bar is like still intact. It's not, it did not even change form. Like it, it gave me lots of lather for washing my hair. It is fantastic. Like the way it felt in my hair when I was massaging my scalp and washing my hair. It was really, really nice. The only thing that happened afterwards is that because of the casser oil in it, it had like this kind of coating on my head. And so my hair was really grippy. And so it did not want to be brushed at all. Not out of the shower directly like this. And so I was like, oh man, because like I was thinking, you know, for camping or like, you know, traveling, this is so awesome because you just have your shampoo and you don't have to carry like liquids and stuff and your shampoo's ready to go. And this really will last a very long time. Now, um, something I did discover though is that if you use that and you apply conditioner from root to tip, like you have to do the full on conditioner. And I just use like an argan oil based conditioner. When I put that in and I mixed it with a little, um, with a little oil that was like, uh, just like some, some extra argan oil, it did really well with combing my hair. And then when my hair naturally dried, it was like really nice. It just felt nice. I knew that that olive oil, the, the castor oil, the shea butter was still on my hair. But the thing is, it hasn't allowed my hair to dry out. And that argan oil conditioner is not like a very high quality one. It's just a real basic one to just do the job. And so it just felt really, really nice. My hair had nice um, movement to it. And so um, this one says for more volume for hair types for frequent use? I say yes. Um, I bet you this is going to be really nice. So I'll be using this one too. So I will just say that it lasts forever. It smells really, really good. The lather is awesome. It does cook your hair though. So like you're not going to be able to brush your hair straight out of the shower. But as long as you add an oil base, like for example, conditioner or argan oil or jojoba or whatever you're using on your hair, um, just a little bit of that will just allow you to detangle your hair so that you can just let your hair dry naturally because that's what I did. I just let it dry natural. And it looked really healthy and really good. So I'm expecting this product to be the exact same way. And then volume is good for me because I need volume in my hair. So I'm looking forward to that attribute in comparison to its other different types that are available by this company. But already I can tell you, it lasts a long time. It's a good product, I think. I think their whole line is so far being a very high-end product. But um, just watch out for that attribute that like you're like oh no my hair's all grippy just get some oil in there you know get a conditioner 
then what you know brush your hair out and let it natural dry and oh it's gonna be so pretty when you're done so so yeah so there you go